Uh, hello Motion Control. Well today it's Sunday, Seahawks Sunday. I'm rooting for the Hawks. Hopefully they do well today. We'll see. Their offensive line kind of sucks right now, so uh, it's always fun to get together go and watch some football. Today we're going to do a quick experiment. I have some uh, reveal time uh, smoke grenades. This is for uh, usually when you have, uh, like you just found out what type of sex your baby's going to be. Uh, you have a pink one and a blue one. But uh, I found these on Amazon and all I really needed was a smoke bomb. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna set off a smoke bomb in here and we're actually gonna see how the air moves inside of the building. And this is important for us for winter time so that we can actually see where we have dead spots which could lead to humidity, um, condensation and everything showing up there uh, which could lead to mold and fungus and rotting and a whole bunch of bad things. So we wanna see when we turn all the fans on, how does the air move? It's also important for us to see how the air moves with respect to the big old giant monster dragon heater that we installed uh, to see if it throws air far enough and if the circulation that we put in here is going to be good enough. So we're going to uh, get the fans turned on and then we're going to set off one of these smoke grenades and see how well it does and just watch how smoke moves in the building and it's going to get probably pretty smoky in here but it should be pretty cool to see so let's get started. Here we go! Well, that thing didn't last very long. So I'm walking to the other end of the building and it is totally smoky down here. So as far as all the smoke goes, or the air, it certainly moves it around. That was a pretty weak smoke grenade though, but like I said, I'm all the way down to the other end and smoke is actually evenly distributed throughout the entire building. So I'm gonna set off another one and see what it looks like, but pretty disappointed in the smoke grenade. So the real good news is that the smoke, look at it come out there. but it is really getting tossed out. And look, uh, see, you kind of see some smokiness over there. It is blowing, there we go, blowing really, really well off of the heater. And it's distributing throughout the building really quickly, which is what we wanted to see. But I was really hoping to be able to get some more of where the actual airflow currents are at. But what I'm taking away from this particular experiment is just that the fans that we have set up right now with the uh, heater blower going definitely distribute the smoke in, or the air in here really rapidly. I mean, rapidly. It, it diffused so quickly. So we might have good enough airflow, but I might look for some better smoke grenades and do this experiment again because those are really weak. Well, they weren't smoke grenades. They were reveal smoke bombs, which were absolutely horrible. <laughs> but uh, so we're gonna check it out, see if we can't find a better one. Maybe if you guys know a better smoke grenade that's out there that lasts longer. We need something that lasts quite a few uh, seconds, like a minute, maybe two minutes would be best. Uh, but it did distribute really quickly in here. So it's looking like we have good enough airflow. I think what we wanna do is probably put two ceiling fans in at the top to help blow heat down after we get the insulation in. I'm seeing that right now, but actually, I have lots of smoke down at this level still, so it's not too bad. Anyway, that was the experiment. Quick and fast, dirty, very smoky in here. Uh, but that was it. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give us a thumbs up and hit subscribe. You can also follow us on Facebook and Twitter. In the meantime, this is Real Martian, out.